New at this hour, Florida's governor weighing in on what some are calling an epidemic. The state's Department of Health investigating several cases of lung disease possibly connected to vaping. ABC Action News reporter Michael Paluska with the governor tonight. I've talked to a lot of parents. It seems like for teens, this has like really exploded in just like two or three years. It's becoming a big problem. The death toll from vaping related lung disease remains at six. Cases are now confirmed at 380. The CDC initially had that number at 450 possible cases, but now they are only counting confirmed and probable cases. The mysterious illnesses now in 36 states and the U.S. Virgin Islands. Only a matter of time before it hits Tampa Bay. State Representative Jackie Toledo wants to raise the legal age to purchase products to 21 and ban the use of flavoring. The announcement made outside of Tampa General Hospital. As physicians, we're all deeply concerned about the health effects of e-cigarettes and specifically and especially their use amongst our young people. While the Department of Health's Bureau of Tobacco-Free Florida teams up with the CDC and Florida Poison Information Center to help identify those new cases, businesses that sell e-cigarettes are worried. It's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. There's nothing else to uh, say about it. I mean, it's, it's, it's something that's life-changing. You know, this is our bread and butter. In Tampa, Michael Paluska, ABC Action News.